Hello. Oh my goodness. It's hard for me to focus because my best friend is standing over There's a hummingbird. <laughs> kissing the hummingbird. I just hear him with... <laughs> Welcome to my birthday trip. Tomorrow, not for me, but for you watching this, I turn 29. Really making this video is simply my way of making sure all of you have no excuse but to wish me happy birthday. Leave it in the comments below. I'm just trying to feel like I have friends, okay? Other than that one. I am doing a little birthday vacay, and later in this vlog, you'll see my little mini birthday party. By the way, I haven't invited you yet. I'm having a birthday party. Yet. Me? Yeah. Oh. I thought this was it. I just assumed you weren't going to come because we're doing this trip together. I, I bought your birthday present though. Oh, I got my first birthday present! Yeah. Wait, when are you going to open it? Right now! Okay, now's a good time. Okay, I have a present for you, by the way, too. Birthday, oh. birthday Christmas, New Year's. Yeah, we're, we're doing <laughs> birthday, Christmas, New Year's because we haven't seen each other in way too long, which is why we're doing this little birthday vacay in Palm Springs. But you really wrapped this good. I did, good luck. Just saying. Damn! So, top, did you do this yourself? I did, I did. I don't know who would hired it, like, wrap presents anymore. This is, um, like, profesh. I'm not ripping it. Um, upside down, I taped it. So that's the access. The access. Yeah, easy access. I have to say, it looks so perfect. <laughs> That's it? What color yeah. is the tissue paper or the wrapping it's paper? Pink. <gasps> pink with flowers. Oh, like, it's so Kind mean. of like, honestly, little girl flowers. Honestly, kind of like, me. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's like blue and hot pink and purple flowers on it. The two gifts have nothing to do with each other, so you can open them in any sequence. Okay. Oh, I should let you open it. I just started. No, I, honestly, <laughs> I'm so bad at opening other people's gifts because I get excited can to I? give it can, to them. Can yeah, I? Yeah, Elton, what are you going to get me for my birthday, babes? What are you gonna get mommy for her birthday? I think he's saying me. <laughs> he says, Grandma, do you have mom's credit card? <laughs> I got him right out pretty quick. Ooh. This is delicate. Yeah, right? Surprise, box of nothing. Ooh. But I want you to feel this. Open this and feel that. Oh my God, there's so much to this. My goodness. <laughs> Any guesses what it, what it might feel like? You feel some texture, right? It feels like plaster. It, well, yeah. It's kind of like plastic. Does it go this way? Yeah. You feel like lines? Yeah. And like, there's a swoopy section here. Yeah, yeah. It looks like someone's haircut. Is it me? <laughs> it's you and me. It's a 3D printed photo. So they've like, you can like, it's textured. <gasps> Is that your hair? Yeah, it's the photo of us sitting outside of Alfred's. Oh. So, oh my god, I have a bun! Yeah, this is your, no, this is the, that's just, that's your hat, oh. your beret. You're wearing a beret, and you can feel even your choker down there. Oh my god, yes! Yes, you can! <laughs> There's your choker, there's your teeth. Oh my god, oh my god, yes, I, I'm smiling! And your nose. So the cool thing about this, this one's a negative photo, so if you hold it up to the light, it looks kind of like, like, our, fa our faces are dark. Um, if you, this one, there's two, so like here, I'll hold it up, kind of looks like a negative. Oh, yeah. But you can see this one here. <gasps> So this is a backlit frame. Oh my god, this is so cool! And I don't know if you can read. That's in braille up there. I did contract it. It's just... Best friend. Is it? Yeah. It's very pointy braille. Yeah. It's like really sharp. It's <laughs> 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 like it, it <laughs> hurts the fingers. <laughs> best friends. Just always best friends. Oh, anyway. always best friends anyway. And so the little battery pack thing, this lights it up away at the top. Oh my god. So you don't have to put it up against a light. It actually like lights up behind it. Ooh, I'm gonna have to turn it. it on in the dark. Yeah, you'll see it better in the dark. You can't really see it out here. But Where did you get this? My ex girlfriend <laughs> has a <laughs> He is gay. But there was a time he pretended. Do you remember the girl that I dated was like in the Miss America competition? Yeah, yeah, yes, yeah. When they were trying one. to make you be straight. Yes. Yes. No. She she broke up with me because I was too homophobic, ironically. <laughs> so she if was the side. She was the canary in the coal gay. mine. <laughs> Does anybody know that song? She has like a three D printing business though, and I saw her doing three D printed like photos of things and I was like, wait. I think a blind person could probably feel like the yeah. lines on it, but even cooler. I don't know if you could see like the actual outlines if you hold it up. I probably to the wouldn't light. be able to. Like maybe if it was a dark room and a bright light, I'd be able to see some of it. Maybe. Yeah. It's so cool. But you can feel at least the lines. The yeah. Screen. I just thought it was cool because it's like we have good photos together and like to make it more visible. Accessible. To you. Yeah. yeah. Okay, and then this is the second one. It's a box. <laughs> What's inside it's the a box? box? You should know. Shake it. This one's not brattle. Sound familiar? It sounds like like a board game or something. We saw it last time we hung out 
at your apartment. We is it a light this. bright? It might be. <laughs> is it a light bright? It's a light bright. Okay, I saw this last time we were together, and Brain's like, don't buy that. Get it on Amazon. They're charging too much because it's a boutique toy store. It was, like, was almost like, like $70 because it's, like, a vintage toy. I won't tell you how much I got that for. It wasn't $70. Like though, yeah. I was like, but maybe I'd be able to see it. I want to play with it and see if I can see it. And he's like, get it on Amazon. You're welcome. I better see that in a video to come. Oh, I'm going to do a whole TikTok try and play with it. Yeah. Do we have what I got Brayden? I didn't wrap it. You're I'm a better friend. No. <laughs> so I wrapped this gift for you. What a beautiful wrap. This is your Christmas You want to help oh. Elton? You want to help me unwrap? Elton's <laughs> right in there. Elton bought it. Elton Person. believed it. Elton's like, look at the wrapping. I love, what did I call it last time? Sajay? <laughs> <laughs> My Sajay. favorite store is Sajay. <laughs> love Sajay. Honestly, and I'm still wearing the deodorant that you got me last time. Festive Diffuser Blend Collection. Here's the Some thing. Some essential oils. They have like the nicest essential oils. And I got Brayden hooked on it. So now I'm like, great, this is an easy gift. I can always just get you that. Especially their deodorant. Cute. Honestly, I use it every single day. Ooh. I thought this would be cute for you and Andrew. Is it going to, like, heal all of our fights? Exactly. <laughs> it's going to heal the wounds. Candle. There's a little candle. Yeah. A time for connection. That's Ooh. adorable. You know what this is for. <laughs> connection. It, said, it says right there. It says right there. It's a time for connection. You can know what it's for. Cabin cozy. Oh, yeah. That smells good. Mm. Sounds very... Like masculine Ooh. in a good yeah, way. Yeah, essential oils. Oh, yes, it's a roller. Do you know what I like to do? I like to like roll it mm. in the palm of my hand, rub them together, and then like cover my. And you take like deep inhale. This was in there too, right? Yes. I'm assuming you're holding cool. up the box. Yes. Cool yes. To connect set of twenty five connection prompts. So that's what I thought would be cute. Ooh. So you like light the candle. You use the oil, a glass of wine, and then you can like do this little game That's together. actually a really great idea. Isn't that cute? Yeah. So Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you for idea. coming on my birthday trip with me. So basically, I'm doing this birthday trip because I'm turning 29. I'm entering my Jeez. final years of my 20s. Stop it. You make me feel bad. It's because you're a year younger yeah, than me. Yeah, it's happening to you first, so I'm just trying to like get prepared. Like, Jeez, wow, that must be really hard for you. <laughs> Coming your way soon, buddy. So we're going to be in Palm Springs for a few days. Brayden's only here for the one night with us. And then we're going to head back for a little tiny mini last minute birthday party. What is one of your favorite memories? It just says in general, it doesn't say Yeah, that's me, a so. really specific open-ended question. Well, you better say it's one with me. How are you really? <laughs> <laughs> when was the last time you cried? Honestly, I love my outfit. That's what I love most. Wait, you cried so much that you loved your outfit? No, I was still on the last question in my mind. Oh, okay. I was trying to think. I was like, what do I love about myself? I know it's a superficial thing, but I love this outfit. I've said it five times today, and they're all sick of hearing it. Isn't this outfit so freaking cute, though? I cried this morning. Oh. <laughs> I mean, I didn't. Tears of joy? <laughs> yes, exactly. When I saw Molly's outfit, I just... <laughs> Overwhelmed. <laughs> when was the last time I cried? Oh, oh, I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> Not like boy related. This is like boy related. The last time I talked to a boy it was you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm offended by that. I'm not a boy. I'm a pretty lady. Exactly. We are okay. So we're sharing a hotel room tonight. I was like trying to be respectful. I was like, I'll give you your own hotel room and like I'll sleep with my parents who both snore. So I was like pretty upset about the idea, but I was trying to be nice. And I was like, brought my headphones. I was gonna block out the. <laughs> 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 and then Brayden was like, you can just stay in my room. Okay, and then he looks at Yeah, I thought it was weird because it's not like really my room. I'm staying in your room that you're going to come into next after me. So I'm like, maybe. Well, that's so that. Like back, so back to the good old days, like we're at Exmo having camp. It's just so good because then he looks at the hotel employees and goes, platonically. Yeah. <laughs> well, just have to clarify. We're getting a couple's massage and they have to know, like, don't don't put rose petals out. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. He booked us a couple's massage and he was like, again, platonically. Like, he's making sure everybody knows. Well, our first, like, years of being friends when you weren't, like, super, like, you were really, your gayness was very under wraps. Like, you were <laughs> openly gay, but you were very straight presenting. Everybody just constantly thought we were boyfriend and girlfriend. Yeah. Like, how long have you been together? And now I think I'm just constantly used to oversharing the details. Like, they didn't ask, but I'm going to tell you anyways. <laughs> You're like, before you ask, we're not together. And I'm now extra gay. I used to be kind of gay, but now I'm, like, extra now gay. Now he has handbags and heels. I do. I actually have a handbag all with me. It's not a... Not a man purse, it's just a purse. It's actually a woman's purse from the women's purse section. Love that for you. Should we get cocktails? I, I can spill my trauma. I think it's a... Let's talk about the last we, time I cried in private. Should we trauma dump? Sorry, time to go. <laughs> we gotta go trauma dump. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you guys, this is like this private patio that we have. It has this large like seating area, but then look at that. 
Look at that. That is an outdoor bathtub, an outdoor private bathtub. And, and, and in the bathroom, I'm gonna be like smuggling all of the bath products and then like every day be like, well, we ran out, <laughs> we need more. It's La Labo Santel 33, which is the unisex fragrance that I wear as my like everyday perfume. And it's expensive. Like I've only ever tried the Labo perfume and I have a candle, but that's it. And they have my scent in the shampoo, the conditioner and the body lotion. And I'm like, it's like that bit. I'm like, that is like a $30 amount, my friends. That's how expensive La Labo is. And Brayden looks at me and goes, great, so we're all gonna smell like you. I literally never heard of La Labo and pull out the bottle and I just kind of like open it for a second and she knew it just by the smell. She's like, <sighs> <laughs> It's me. Yes, I smell again. She like actually smelled the other It doesn't, thing. no, it doesn't, you don't smell anything. Um, get in, no, go underneath the cardigan. Oh my God, I don't wanna get that close. <laughs> Morning. My hair, come on in. Like a grape. How are you doing? I'm good. Oh, now he gets up. <laughs> Hello. Now he gets up because his biggest fan is here. Hello. 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 You are on camera. Oh, what? <laughs> yes, you walked in with the camera. <laughs> Jesus. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> so today, Brayden was so sweet and he treated me to a massage at a spa nearby. It was glorious, so relaxing. I was having very, very, very bad anxiety because I've been having really bad anxiety lately. It's been fun. And um, I couldn't sleep last night because I was making myself anxious, which is the second night in a row that I did not sleep. So then I was getting really anxious. And so we went for a massage and it helped slow my heart rate down, the like deep pressure slowed my heart rate down. And now exhaustion is hitting me of two days of no sleep or very little sleep. So Elton and I are gonna sit outside or lay outside on our little outdoor bench and take a little nap. Oh, and last night, Brayden and I stayed up for like an hour in the outdoor bathtub in our swimsuit. Clearly we've worn her out. Yeah. Oh. The tail the wagging. I'll see you soon. I'll see you Saturday. Oh, he says, Brain, I'm so tired. I know. Nap, You're all man. tired. Did yeah. you get up at 5 30 for <laughs> breakfast? That's not normal. You want to know why she's tired? 5 30 breakfast. He says, oh, on the me, dot. It's usually five. <laughs> I let her sleep in a little because I was tired. So, the hotel I'm staying at for my birthday trip is like very old Hollywood. It's been here since the 1930s and has a ton of history. Lots of celebrities still come here. I mean, like just Palm Springs in general has a lot of Hollywood history. But, this hotel, this hot tub at the hotel was built because Shirley Temple wanted it. It's the Shirley hot tub. In Goals. the shape of a flower. And it's a, fl a flower. So it has all these like little nooks that you can sit in and it makes a flower when you look at it. How iconic, like the amount of influence. Just be like, I would like a hot tub. And they're like, yes, Shirley, whatever you want, Shirley. Guess what I had last night? Hot tub. I had Elton John pizza. It was, called, it, was it good? It was called the Elton John. Yeah, it was good. I liked the um, I liked the addition of mushrooms and olives. Mm -hmm. It was mine. Whilst everybody has been struggling to find their way around this twisty windy resort, Elton John has had zero issues. I picked up his harness at the pool, told him to go, and he just immediately took me to the room, which is a windy path, not straightforward, and a little far away. Killed it. Killing it, bubs. Okay, so I took a delightful outdoor bath today or like this evening and then just kind of hung out in my room, slowly took my time getting ready. Uh, like I said earlier in the vlog, I've been dealing with a lot of anxiety, so I have not filmed as much as I've wanted to because I've not been, you know, feeling my best. But I am currently sitting outside. I've been trying to wear like my, my favorite outfits to make me feel good because it's my birthday trip and I just want to feel my best. So I'm wearing this outfit for the first time. I'll try to get a better shot like in the light someday to insert in it. I might even wear it at my birthday party, who's to know? But it's just like all these fun cartoons and colors. It's just like a long sleeve top and sweatpants, but elevated. And then I have Converse and this cozy jacket on. And we're sitting outdoors at our hotel by the fireplace. It's like this little outdoor fireplace. It's very tiny, but it's nice. We're just having a cocktail before we head to dinner. And I got the Purple Gang. Purple's my favorite color. And it's like a tequila based drink. Tequila and gin are my two favorite hard liquors. And it's kind of like a margarita with a twist. I'm very excited. It's like ginger, lemon, lime, purple stuff. It's like a violet something. Um, so let's give it a try. Do I have to mix it, you guys? Can, can you see? No. Ooh. Yeah, it's very yummy. There's actually like a long history of like, like 
dark stuff that happened at this hotel. It actually started as like a smuggling place for these gangs in the 30s. And uh, they used to have tunnels underneath the hotel that went to the airport so that they could smuggle things. It's, it's wild. I'm gonna have to learn more about it, but all the old Hollywood stars came here. At one point, it was a uh, brothel. Lots happened here. A lot of ghosts. I don't know if I'd say good history <laughs> needs. I don't think that's the word. Good kind of yeah, so, stories. Purple Gang pays homage. I think the gang who settled here was the pur called the Purple Gang. Pays homage to the uh, ex extensive history. So we're at the restaurant now. I just finished my final bite of a garlic rosemary bread. It was phenomenal. And I have water in, look, the bubble glass that I talked about in this video here. So many of you have sent me links of where I can buy these online, so thank you, I so appreciate you. And I am getting an heirloom burrata salad. I love heirloom tomatoes, oh, it's so good. And like a soft burrata cheese, basil, balsamic. It's like one of my absolute favorites. Hard not to order for me when it is on the menu. Also, when we walked in, there was a neon sign that said, you're like really pretty. And if you know, you know. That is a Mean Girls quote, which is one of my favorite movies because I was Katie growing up. And when that movie came out, I was like, I am seen. And I grew up like loving Lindsay Lohan when I was really young because everybody told me I looked like her. I don't think I do, but as a child I did. And so I just loved her. And when she was in that movie and she was like the only girl, I was like, oh, I feel seen. So I loved that movie growing up. I could quote a lot of it, but anyways. I've been trying to find a neon sign that I like to put above my vanity in my condo. And I'm like, my dad was like, that would work perfectly over the vanity. You're like really pretty. And I was like, boom. It works because it's my vanity where I do my makeup. It's like a positive affirmation. And it's a quote from my favorite movie. So I think we nailed it. You're like really pretty. This is carrot cake. Carrot cake and red velvet are my two favorite cakes. I think it's because they both have cream cheese icing and I love cream cheese icing. I do love cheesecake too, but it's has the right cheesecake. Anyways, I'm going on a tangent. Apparently it has a pink candle and now I have to make a wish. And I am sharing this with both my parents. I'm not eating this whole mass of teas. Okay. What should I wear? Okay. Oh, you do it! Yay! Okay. Is it good? I love it. It's more savory. The carrot cake is more savory. It is a Thursday at one in the afternoon. We have been here since Monday around one, um, and we're leaving tomorrow probably around one. I am just sitting by the pool. I've got my sparkling water my favorite dad joke flat water in a sparkly bottle <laughs> equals sparkling water it's spa water it's made with watermelon it's delightful all i've had today is a protein bar so i really need to go get lunch um i'm wearing my sunglasses the ones i got for christmas my palm springs trip is the first time i've been wearing them so it feels like I'll have like a nice good memory attached to them and it's funny because Palm Springs is where I got my Fendi ones and these are attempting to replace. I have two of these long sleeve long sleeve swimsuits and every time I wear them people ask me where I got them. Both of them are from Billabong and they're so cute, so comfortable. It's like nice protection from the sun as well except not on the back because the back is, the back is really she's out. Okay, so I just had to run in and quickly go pee at a grocery store and I left Elton in the car because I was literally going in to pee and come back. And my mom says we were walking out of the car, he's looking out the window. Elty! Elty! Hi, baby! How did you get yourself on the seat? I was just going for a minute. Excuse me. You guys were sharing a seat. How did you do this? It is our final night. I am wearing the same outfit as last night. I am an outfit repeater. I had this dress I really wanted to wear, but it's just too chilly and we really wanted to sit outside. We're at this restaurant called Copley's and we are like nailing it. We lived here for a month over the holidays and somehow this trip of five days, we're finding like four nights, five days, we're finding all of the best restaurants. Um, so we're at this place called Copley's, which used to be Cary Grant's, on Cary Grant's estate and they've turned it into a restaurant. And to start, we're getting some bread. So it's a cornbread with something like rosemary, salt, and what's the mushroom I love? Come on, you guys, you know it. It's the mushroom. No, it's rosemary garlic roll. It's a truffle butter. Truffle butter, truffle. Oh, truffle butter. And then we're also having a prosciutto melon burrata salad. I'm very excited. And I have some sparkling water with lime. We just got back from dinner. I want to show you guys the outfit in like good lighting. 
just all of these colorful, interesting cartoon kind of things on it from what I'm understanding. And it has just these interesting details. It's a mock neck. And then I get like the sweatpants, but they're like elevated sweatpants. They have this like black piping on the back and the front. I don't know, it's just like a very cool outfit. So that's the outfit in the lighting. It is probably approaching 10 o'clock at night and I am gonna go for a bedtime swim since it's my last night. The pool is heated to like 80 or 90 degrees and the hot tub's 102 and it's open 24 seven. I've been to many hotels in my life. I've never heard of that. So I'm very excited for my outdoor bedtime swim. A little nervous because it's freezing out because the desert at night, especially in the winter is so cold. So I'm a little bit nervous. What's happening? I'm trying to get in, but I'm scared to take my robe off. Okay, I'm gonna take it off. I'm gonna be fine. Okay, Elton, can you protect my robe? <laughs> this is where it gets cold. <laughs> Feeling cold? It's warm till right now. You guys know. I'm doing it. You're doing it! Oh. Oh. You proud of me? I am so proud of you. And Elton is wagging his tail down there. <laughs> Elton, you're not going in there. <laughs> I don't think you want a wet dog going to bed. Is he walking back and forth? Yeah. I can hear his feet. He is wagging his tail. <laughs> Why are you following me? He says, I'm worried about you. He says, that's enough now, come in. <laughs> Hi baby, I'm fine. I'm fine. <laughs> oh yeah, this is worth it. He's not too happy about this. Hi. Are you okay? Hello. Hello. How was it? Good. I'm glad I did it. I used my pr private outdoor bathtub twice, and I come in the hot tub and pool twice. That I've made good use. Very nice in there. Oh, hello. Look at you. Hello. Are we Birthday filming? girl, yes we. Yeah, we're filming. Okay. Look at you. Oh. <laughs> Don't trip. That's my job. Okay, so last night we got home from Palm Springs, or like in the evening. And then we've just been getting ready because like 10 days ago I decided to have a last minute birthday. Um, so I just like invited some of my LA friends and I'm all ready. I we loved, changed the outfit. Yes. It was another outfit. We did a last minute change. I picked this dress. Well, my Patreons helped me pick this dress. By the way, I have a Patreon up below. And they helped me pick this dress out. And then my mom was like, oh. <laughs> So. <laughs> and to me, it was more of a lunch dress. So I've changed. This is more like a fluffy birthday. So I have fluffy. this. I've never worn it before. I just got it. Um, and it's this bodysuit. Uh, and it's from Simon's. And I got it on sale for like $45 or something. It's really, really good. And then I have my iconic pleated pants. We know I love them. And then I just have like this bralette under. I could go without, but I actually think it looks cuter with the bralette peeking out. And then I just have these stilettos, like clear strap black stilettos and a sparkly lip, my hair up. That's the look for the party. Now we are awaiting people's arrivals. I'm a little anxious, theme of the video, but I'm excited to see all my friends. It's gonna be fun. Like, I, I feel like I'm a human love. loofah. Like a yeah. loofah with a human and Oh my God, I love it. And the shoes. Hi, say hello, Robin. <laughs> hello. <laughs> Water in a wine glass. <laughs> We got Mo, Julie's here. Hi, Julie. <laughs> hey, Molly. Oh, hi. Oh, hi, Molly. Oh, you're here. It's me. Oh, my God. We're so glad you're here. Hey, Come on. Look at this. Is this not the most awesome thing you've ever seen? Of course we've okay. Yes. Who are you? Who are you? This is Chris, and this is... <laughs> Molly's dad. Okay, it's funny. This gift is kind of funny. Okay. okay. Oh, this part is not funny. So <laughs> <laughs> this this feels like part. food. It is a soap. Oh. oh. But if you oh. open it, it's a honeycomb soap. 
Oh, I love all the bee gifts that yeah. mom's getting. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, that is cool. It, it smells good too. Oh, that's yeah. beautiful. It's a honeycomb. Very it's one cool. of those soaps you want to like display but never use. Yeah, yeah. 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 like this is gift my dad's gonna die when he hears that. Cause I, he thinks <laughs> I'm- Well, I, we can add to the candles we never burn. Oh! <laughs> oh, this that's such a good one. Oh, I love this one! Yeah, the, mm. And the bottle is so pretty. It's like a bottle you refill and use for water. Right? Yeah, 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 like it's just so pretty. Right. Fancy. Uh -huh. Over his affection by like buying him things. I'm like, stop bribing the dog. It's like, to be clear, I can be bribed. Yeah. So, I'm manipulating <laughs> my way to the top. I used to use cheese for Gala, but now I know. Yeah. Are you tired? I am so tired. I'm so <laughs> lame. Literally. But you had such a good time. By like 10 30, I was like, okay, everyone. Oh, who's that? <laughs> Sound effects. He has to hydrate before bed after a night of partying, you know? Mm hmm. Yeah, I, I'm like, I just want to like get a Crunch? hot water bottle and go to bed. Um, But everybody was having me open their gifts. So this is from my editor, Robin. It's so cool. It's a custom charcuterie board, which literally earlier today, we were talking about how I don't have any charcuterie boards here. It's All true. of them are in my BC I was place. looking today and was like, crap, we have none. And now we do. So Yay. she got a B on it. This is Never. Burke. Never. It says Burke. Yeah. And then it Where like, did Robin get that? I don't know. She Robin, pop it on the screen, girl. She gets the coolest person. She does. Honestly, Robin is queen gift giver. So that was the last one from Robin, which is so beautiful with Braille on it. And then look. The bottom row wow. has like the little... That's incredible. I've never seen one like that. And then for storage, it just... Never. And she got um, catnip and two squeaky dog wine bottles. And Elton is so boys. thrilled. Yeah, I haven't told him the second one's for Gallup yet, so... Okay, and then my friend... I really wasn't expecting people to get me gifts. This is so sweet. My friend got me this candle. Oh my gosh, look at Elton. He's so interested. Okay, see we got this bee candle? And it smells really good. Like passion fruit. That's a candle? Yeah. That's gorgeous. And then she got this and it says, um, don't worry, be happy. Oh, that's so beautiful. Which I need that encouragement. Actually, I need, don't worry, don't be anxious. <laughs> and then look, this is from Mo and Chris. They got me this Elton John. Oh, what is he doing? I told my dad to try to get his toy from him. <laughs> so this is a like Elton John piece of artwork. And it's the Rocket Man piece, which was Elton John's nickname. LT, yeah. Did Grandpa take your toy, or do you still have it? No, nope. you don't have it. <laughs> He's very good at answering my questions. So I got this cool bath mix and these really cool like drink mixes from B. And then from Julie, I got some Merit Beauty. I got the cream blush. No. And I got a serum. Wow. I'm really excited. And then I don't know. I think my mom said. You guys saw what T got me, but in case you didn't, she got me a bottle of wine, a really cool like soap that's like a honeycomb, and some poppy soda. Hello, it is the next morning, and the great news is I don't have a hangover because I only had one glass of wine. That's the good news about being too anxious. I'm actually feeling really good today. I'm feeling the best I've felt in quite a few weeks, anxiety level wise. I think it's just because I had this night surrounded by so many incredible people who I love so much, they all just made me feel so like loved and cared for and special and I appreciate each and every single one of them for coming and enjoying this special day with me and on my actual birthday which is tomorrow for all of you Wednesday or maybe it's today I don't it depends when I when I get this video ready <laughs> to post um, because it's last minute and so every time the video is like last minute for Robin sweet sweet Robin I always tell her I'm like if we have to post this the day after it's fine so maybe it's actually Wednesday who knows but I'm actually getting a facial and just like enjoying maybe like a nice lunch out or dinner out with my parents and that's how I'm spending the actual day itself but I feel so celebrated and so full that I'm like, do I even need that? Like, it's just been a really lovely celebration to enter my final year of my 20s. I'm looking forward to it, all the ups and downs it is sure to bring. And I will see you in the next video. Thank you so much for being with me for yet another year. And here's to the next one ahead. Okay, you can click over here for this vlog or over here for this one. Bye.